Happy Monday to you, friends. Cold front day. That cold front swept through this morning, this afternoon. Temperatures will hold steady into the 50s, diminishing rain chances as that north winds offers up some drier air. The clouds stick around. It's going to keep temperature readings hovering somewhere in the upper 40s once the sun goes down. You can see by 6, 7 o'clock this evening, those temperatures widespread 40s. A few spots south of I-10 will be in the 50s. And there will be a strong breeze associated behind the front. 15 to 25 mile per hour winds will be ongoing throughout the evening. Meanwhile, let's fast forward to tomorrow morning as an area of low pressure develops along this front. This low pressure system is going to parallel our coastline, but it is going to draw in some moisture as early as the morning commute. And these rain showers will be ongoing at times. We could pick up some brief heavy downpours. Some of these cells could uh, bring in a half an inch to even three quarters of an inch of rain in some spots. There there could be a few claps of thunder, but uh, as far as severe weather, we're not looking a profile for that. We are going to be dealing with diminishing rain chances once the sun goes down. So for tomorrow, look at uh, some better rain chances through the first part of the day. Rainfall totals anywhere between a half an inch to an inch possible. I think we see some of the higher rainfall totals north and east of the Houston area, followed by the southwest side, maybe a quarter of an inch for you. Here's a look at your Tuesday hour by hour forecast right now as of the latest models. I'm thinking the rain chances peak sometime around sunrise and will be ongoing mid to late morning, early part of the afternoon. The temperature should be hovering in the upper 40s all day long. So along with that jacket, you're going to want to keep that umbrella handy. Get ready for a second front. This second front arrives on Friday. Still some uncertainty to the timing of this front, either Friday morning or Friday afternoon. But regardless, this one also has some cold air that's going to be invading our air. Area, dropping those temperatures from highs on Thursday into the 70s to lows over the weekend, dipping to near freezing, even below freezing when you walk out the door on Sunday morning. So we've got a little bit of a roller coaster here of temperatures. We will only warm today into the 40s as those temperatures have already fallen. Then tomorrow we could be sitting in the 40s all day long. We peak in those highs in the low 70s on Thursday, followed by temperatures tumbling over the weekend and then by next week we see another nice warm-up all right that's a look at your forecast on this monday thanks for watching